Hey, what's up, everybody? Fade here, and welcome back to a new video. Today, I'll be reacting to uh, something that I believe happened today, actually, right here. KSI versus Joe Fournier. So, uh, I will leave the link to... Well, actually, never mind. I will... Uh, I have a... There's a chance that this might get hit with a copyright claim. And... If it does, then I will leave a link to, I guess, uh, the Misfits or the DAZN thing or whatever. And I'll leave a link to that in the description if you guys want to go to that. If that ends up being the case. Um, but either way, we're going to watch this. This is uh, KSI vs. Joe Fournier. Uh, pretty sure this fight happened earlier today, if not yesterday. It'll be probably like a day or two after uh, the fight, whenever you guys get to see this, considering I'm recording it like the day before I release it. So, yeah. I already know what the result of this fight is, but I want to actually see the fight. So, I don't know if this is actually the full fight like the title says, but I guess we'll see. Oh my god. Really? Okay, so this motherfucker can just profit off of someone else's uh, boxing match? Come on. Yeah, this is 100% isn't the whole fucking fight. They're 100% just taking clips. Oh my fucking god, dog. Like, this isn't even the fight. Okay, we're just now getting into the fights and we're... We're just now getting into the fights and we're fucking four minutes in all right we're finding a new video um is this it no this could be it but it's 30 minutes let's click on this and i'm just gonna skip to uh the fight part i'm just gonna skip to when they actually start fighting right here okay no earlier in the video uh, no, I think I'll just skip the bits in between. Oh, not right here. Jesus, these cats are getting loud. Alright, let's just get right here. This video is loud as hell, too. Okay, got a bit of an interesting thing from both of them. KSI, it looks like it looks like JJ it looks like KSI is just trying to lure him in. Wait, hold on, let me make sure the quality of this video is the best that it can be. Why is that four? The highest it can be is 480p. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so I was just trying to lure him in. Oh. He didn't even get punched either. He cl he lost a clinch and then fell over. He didn't even get punched. What even happened right there? Damn. Why does he keep going for the leg shot, though? What the hell was that? Ooh. 
the hell are they doing? Oh. What the hell? Uh, I think JJ's trying to get Joe on the ropes. Looks like it. He's already... Come on. Jesus Christ. We got a minute left in this first round. And there's been like three punches landed. I'll make that four. What the hell is Joe's stance? It looks like he's trying to go southpaw, but he just... Oh my god. the hell? That is a weird way to dodge punches. I remember KSI when he had that uh, when he had that I guess face off with Dylan Dennis when Kai Sinat kind of like was the middleman for that or whatever and they just it was kind of like a press conference. Kai Sinat hosted it. It was just a Discord call between the three of them. Where they were just like talking shit or whatever. But I remember Dylan tried to call out uh, KSI for uh, all of his opponents go lowering their heads like that. Whenever they get in the ring with them. And KSI was all like, yeah, because they're scared. They're scared I'll hit them in the head too hard. So they just lower their head. To be fair, it looks like he used it in a good way considering he dodged the punch and didn't get punched in the neck. So, it looks like he was fine after that, but still. I was wondering when that bell was going to go off. I was about to say the bell's off. What the hell is going on? Okay, I don't want to see any of this. I'm just going to stick with the rounds. Okay, let me unmute this. Okay, let's see here. Oh, they're hit. They're landing more punches on each other. Good. Okay. Okay. The, these fucking commentators are annoying. Can you stop like slamming your mic on the damn table? Oh. These stances are confusing to me. You can tell they're both scared to go in on each other. Otherwise, they'd be going in. Like, I don't know if y'all remember when KSI went against FaZe Temper. But he was fully willing to just go all in on him. He didn't do any, any like, wasting time. He just went straight in. He went in guns blazing and fucked him up. Looks like he's trying to be more patient in this match. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Hold on. Go back to that. I gotta see this. I need to see it slower. Uh, playback speed... 0.25. That, that, that was it. That was it right there. He hit him... I don't know if you guys saw that. But, I'm gonna rewind it again. And... Right... Sorry about that awful audio. But, if you look right here... Bam! That was an elbow shot. KSI just hit the guy with an elbow shot. I'm going to play it again in 
regular speed. But I don't think it was, and he's gonna catch it the same way. Yeah, that that's a fucking elbow shot. It was an accidental elbow shot, but it was an elbow shot. He looks pissed. I don't I don't think KSI should get the win. I don't think Joe should get the win either, but I don't think KSI gets the win here. Cause yeah, the guy's knocked out, but it was an elbow shot. What the hell is going to be going on throughout the rest of this? Of course he's out there doing push-ups. What the hell is that guy doing? That overhand right was really good. Then he went in, tried to like go in for a knockout blow. That's an elbow shot. That's obviously an elbow shot. I'm sorry, this song this song sounds so awful with the way the audio quality is in this. Also was that was that Mr. Beast? Okay, I am not watching the rest of this twenty minutes.
Okay, I am glad, because I, I know that KSI was planning on doing this, so this isn't as much of a surprise. But, uh... I'm gonna be honest, though. Tommy Fury has only been fighting bums. Up until Jake, like, Jake Paul was... Like, he has the best boxing record out of all the people that Tommy Fury has fought. So, yeah, Tommy Fury has more experience, but if you want to go... Ah, uh, damn, what's that, what's that fucking website called that they went to to, like, check the wins and losses? Uh, like, just check the boxing records. Like, if you go to that, the people that Tommy Fury's beat was, like... I think there was one guy that was, like, 2 in 100... Like, yeah, there were, he had, like, nine wins before Jake, but they were all bums. Like, I think the most amount of wins that anyone he's fought had was four. So, yeah, this guy's just, he's, which it makes sense, especially in your early uh, years of boxing. You want to fight against, like, bums because you want to be able to build up your boxing record to maybe, uh fight against better opponents later but like jake was tommy's best opponent and now he's about to get in the ring with ksi assuming he, is, he accepts this fight which ksi is easily going to be the best boxer that he has ever fought uh, ever fought well to be fair we don't know whether jake paul or ksi is better but we do know that tommy fury beat jake paul so, if this KSI versus Tommy Fury fight happens, and KSI wins, we'll know that, kinda already, that KSI is better than Jake Paul. Or at least, whenever they both fought Tommy Fury. But, yeah, I kinda wanna at least see the rest of this encounter. Then once I finish this encounter, I think I'll end the video. Are they swinging? Or are they just separating each other? What's going on? What happened? Hold on, I'm rewinding. They swing? Damn, you can tell KSI's just trying to slowly wake, make his way up there. But his, but his people are just stopping him. These motherfuckers with their cameras and shit are kind of annoying too. I'd say July, August would be a good time for him to fight uh, Tommy Fury. Is the rest of... Does Tommy Fury stay on this stage for the rest of the fight? What the hell is this? Oh. Uh, I'm not watching the rest of this. Okay. So, as I said, I do think that, uh... That... Like, July to August would be a good time frame for the Tommy Fury fight with KSI to happen. Either that, or they should hold that off at least until after KSI and Fournier have their second fight. Because I don't think... I think Fournier was kind of done dirty there with that, uh, <laughs> with that elbow shot. So, yeah. That's the opinion on that. Good job to KSI, but that was a clear elbow shot. I don't think he, uh... I'm not gonna say he didn't earn that win. But I will say, he shouldn't have got the win after the elbow shot. They should have either given... I don't think they should have given Fournier the win, because he would have lost anyways. Like, especially with how much pressure he was getting from KSI already. But... I don't think that either person should win. I think it should should have been a no contest. 
and that they should uh, run it back, do another uh, fight in like a month or two, maybe three, give them more time to train or whatever. And then like July, August, have them come back into the ring and fight. And then later down the line, then have the Tommy Fury fight. And then after Tommy Fury, maybe at the end of the year or like at the end of the year, either actually have the Jake fight happen, like what he said was going to happen at the end of the year. Or if Jake decides not to want to fight him, then he can just uh, fight someone else. And then hopefully in 2024, uh, Jake will stop being a pussy and actually uh, accept the fight and actually fight the guy. But either way, it doesn't matter. It's just boxing at the end of the day. It's not like lives are going to be changed from this or anything. But yeah, we're going to see. Hopefully we'll see a KSI versus Tommy Fury fight. I'm hoping for KSI to win that one. I'm not really much of a fan of Tommy Fury. Uh, fair play to him for beating Jake Paul. That was easily his biggest opponent. So, yeah, there's that. But I think that's all I have for now, though, guys. So, uh, I'm going to end the video here. If you like what you saw, please leave a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss an upload. If you want to check out my other socials, go to the best section of the channel. Or to the description of this video and all my other videos. Uh, sorry about the, the fan spinning in the background. Along with if you heard any kittens meowing in the background. Or anybody talking outside. Uh, there's some things going on in my house. With the people talking and all that. My fan is just really shit. And I have kittens like right next to my bed. That are just chilling here. So that's probably where the meowing came from. If you guys heard any meowing. But with that all being said. My name is Fate. This has been me reacting to the KSI versus. Uh, what's the guy's name? Joe Fournier? Yeah. Uh, KSI versus Joe Fournier fight. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.